Hey, lovelies. Prism keeps kicking me out. Boom. Giving me the boot. So, whatevs. I've got to make a video. <laughs> a vlog. Let me vlog it. Now, I know. Wheel of Fortune. The new edition. Wheels of Misfortune. Still working on it, but or Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Misfortune. Still working on the name. But that is what we're going to be playing something different anyway we'll see if it works if it doesn't work it's just a brainstorm idea i'll come up with something else okay now i really want you guys to see this oh my gosh i'm just about to get emotional Ugh. i don't want to get emotional i'm not going to get emotional i'm going to hold it together okay holding it together but I want you to see this. This is something that really is important. With approximately 950 of them being unsheltered. Homelessness continues to be a major issue in Philadelphia, notably on Kensington Avenue. In the city, approximately 5,700 people are considered homeless, with approximately 950 of them being unsheltered. In comparison to other parts of Philadelphia, this side of town has the highest concentration of homeless people. Homelessness is caused by a variety of factors, including poverty, inability to afford a place to live, and falling outside of the system, all of which makes meeting housing requirements more difficult. Sometimes mental illness plays a role. Many new people have become homeless as a result of the opioid crisis. Although the homeless population is spread throughout Philadelphia, including Center City, and across the country, Kensington Avenue has the highest number of homelessness. Being homeless or suffering from a mental illness is not a crime. It is also not illegal to sit, occupy, or sleep in public places. Law enforcement officials do not arrest homeless people.
because doing so reduces their chances of finding housing and raises the public sector's cost. Law enforcement officers are always looking for ways to help those in need of a place to live while also protecting the rights of residents, businesses, and visitors. The COVID pandemic has also exacerbated Philadelphia's homeless population. In addition to dealing with a massive increase in the number of homeless people in Philadelphia, there has been an increase in drug consumption. More notably for Kensington Avenue, the reason you see many people sleeping while standing, drowsing, and bending over is due to the drug xylazine. is a sedative with analgesic and muscle relaxing properties that are used in veterinary medicine. It is used to calm and facilitate the handling of a variety of animal species including cattle, sheep, and horses, as well as to perform diagnostic and surgical procedures, relieve pain, and act as a local anesthetic. In Philadelphia, Zalazine began to gain popularity in the mid-2010s. Whoa, I just had to show you guys that, they're tranquilizing people, pretty much, so, food for thought. <laughs>